and we're live um guys Darren Till missed weight so now I'm pretty sure he's gonna win we all know that the recent scandal in MMA that's rocked MMA is the fact that every single fighter that has missed weight is undefeated this year all of them so they've clearly found a way to cheat in MMA and Darren Till is no different see I've always wondered why people said Darren Till is big. He's a big welterweight. Clearly now we see why. He he missed weight, ladies and gentlemen. Um, <clears throat> Stephen Wonderboy Thompson just made weight. He missed it by one pound, but that's leeway. Um, Darren Till, even with his efforts to cheat the scale, came in at, I think, three pounds overweight. Yeah, he's clearly going to win this one. Unless Wonder Boy slaps a crazy, crazy, crazy submission on him. Um, I don't see Wonder Boy winning this in an easy way, man. <clears throat> I, I really don't. You know, I like both those guys. I'm good friends with Stipe. Stipe is a, he's, he's just a monster heavyweight, man. He's fast, good wrestler. <laughs> Um, I don't know. It's a good one. I'm going for my man Stipe, to be honest with you. Of course, I know a lot of guys are going for the underdog, but, uh, you know, Cormier just because he's smaller. But you got to remember, that guy has fought got some big dudes, Bigfoot Silva. I think he knocked him out. I, th I think he broke both of his hands during that fight or injured both of his hands. I don't remember that, I think, but what I recall, I think he did. But uh, Stipe is a beast, man. That's going to be that's gonna be a hard one to call, but I'm going for my man Stipe. Stephen Wonderboy Thompson on uh, DC versus Stipe. Oh man, I love I love Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. He's he's such an amazing fighter, such a a progressive thinker. But um, in this scenario, no, I do not agree with you in one single bit. You want to talk wrestling? Um, DC is an Olympian. DC trains with Cain Velasquez. DC trains with Khabib Nurmagomedov. DC can wrestle. Let's not talk wrestling with DC. Um, yes, Steve Bay's a monster heavyweight, but guess what? DC is undefeated at heavyweight. What more do you need, man? What more do you need? He is just that phenomenal. What you you wanna talk boxing? Um, you just said he knocked out Bigfoot Silver, right? Broke both his hands doing it. And this was Bigfoot Silver on TRT. Strike Force Bigfoot Silver. Probably juiced up Bigfoot Silver. DC shut him down. Who else you want to put up there? Frank Mir? Oh, DC shut him down too. DC, DC, he's been shutting down people for a while, man. Especially at heavyweight. Let's not act like DC isn't isn't one of the most dominant heavyweights ever um let's not act like dc hasn't accomplished what he's accomplished man uh i, I strongly disagree with uh steven wonderboy thompson but he's entitled to his opinion as for him winning this upcoming fight against darren till i don't think it's gonna happen uh, i don't think he's winning this simply because um uh, Darren Till's cheating, man. Apparently, he's been missing weight. Um, he's missed weight four out of his last five fights. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. So, these people have been cheating. They found the, the cheat code in MMA, and it's missing weight. Yeah. But on to other news. Nick Diaz allegedly is uh behind bars for domestic case he um, allegedly choked out some chick um allegedly beat up i don't know uh he was confronted by police allegedly he got into an altercation with the police they called in 12 squad cars whole bunch of hoopla on twitter I don't know if it's true, but if it is, man, this is bad. This is bad. 
This means that when Conor McGregor returns to MMA, he's probably going to have to fight both Diaz brothers simply because of the dumb shit they do. Both of them will be associated with doing dumb shit. And, well, Nate already has a beef with Conor McGregor. They should do the trilogy simply because of money. I don't think it'll sell now. The hype is dead. Um, <clears throat> we've seen it twice. As for Nick, he has a shot there. Um, this is true, man. This is really disappointing. This is really disappointing, man. I mean, this is what? Two low blows for MMA in three months? Conor McGregor with the dolly. Now this. You know, I, I'm, I'm really... Uh, if Nick Diaz really did this, he deserves a donkey of the day, man. He really deserves it. He's an asshole for doing this, man. He really deserves it. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, and I am out.